Hello everyone, I hope you're all doing very well. Today is every other Friday and every other Friday we do a mission for our Patreon donators just to thank them for their service. So today we've decided to do the Grim Reapers or one of the Grim Reapers public World War II servers. It's just something different and we love World War II. So I've gone into the multiplayer lobby of Open Beta 2.7.1. I've typed Grim in the search and let's see if I can find it. Uh, it is this Grim Reapers Open World War II server. It's a very low ping for me at least because it's in Anglais and it has no password. So we are going in boys. The server basically runs two missions, uh, one after the other on an endless loop. Uh, there are two. One is the Normandy mission, which is pretty complex and lengthy. The other one, which we're going to look at tonight, is the Channel mission, which is a much shorter mission, uh, a much simpler mission. And basically, you have what you would expect, Blue, which is uh, uh, sighted in the UK. And you've got red, which are the which is basically Germany ch uh, sighted over in France, and down the middle runs the channel. And basically, as you might expect, you're going to see red air raids coming over from time to time. You'll see red engaging in anti-shipping, uh, which you know you need to protect our ships, and also blue will be well blue will be trying to stop those german attacks by ai usually and um also there are ground targets for blue to attack the missions basically come up in a sequence as one is completed another one will appear you get a message in the top right hand uh, corner of the screen telling you to check the f10 map and off the f10 map you will see marks added in where there is a mission and if you click on the uh, on the mark you'll get a description of uh, what the mission objective is it's fairly straightforward fairly simple uh, but it's a good place to go to get some basic warbird experience are you doing air to air then uh, RT? if you're going to be a spit no spit does very well on both both air to air and air to ground and anti-ship so it's a wow. pretty darn multi-purpose. All right, it, okay. I'm going to clip wing then. Good. Clip wing, spit it, spit it is, boys. Right, regarding engine cooling, RT, is there anything to know, or is it going to be pretty much automatic, or is there anything I can just set now so I don't have to worry about it? If you're in the, the spit, it's basically automatic. However, yeah, yeah. I, once I'm in the air, tend to switch on the radiator flap. I switch it to on, and that way I know it's there. You can overheat, you know, if you're in a dogfight on automatic. I tend to find, so I prefer to switch it on myself. Can you tell me where it is roughly? It's a long time. Uh, since by this. your left hip, just by the um, rudder trim wheel. I've got rad flap, is that it? Yep, that's the one. Right, so we've gone from off to on. There is no auto. Yeah. Okay, guys, I don't really know what expecting so let's just see what happens aha I've got an axis set to my brake just as I thought I needed so that's good news right where are you guys by the way check flaps up I'm just taxiing around the perimeter towards the end of the runway though I mean this is grass you can take off anywhere in any direction oh, I, see, I see one of you okay haha <laughs> I'm not dead yet right we wait for the other two come on you two well, the, the first thing on this that happens is the red do a 4A8 uh, strike against uh, some blue ships which are off Dungeness, which can be intercepted. Approximately 10 minutes later, you get a JU-88 raid with a 12 or so uh, JU-88s flying basically over the Channel Coast heading towards London, which need to be intercepted. But you have lots of blue AI Spitfire support to take them down as well. Uh, from then on, really, you're looking for the uh, markers as they appear on the map, which will sort of tell you what to do. But basically from then on, it's anti-ship or, or ground attack. Roger. Uh, now the bad thing there is... Are there are a couple of red caps, one sort of a northern cap and a southern cap. The northern cap sort of sweeps round by Dunkirk. Southern cap's much further south, which you can tangle with if you so wish. 
I'm a bit embarrassed. I just emergency jettison my canopy. I didn't realise uh, you could even do that. So it's going to be a loud mission, I'm afraid, valued viewers. There's not a great deal I can uh, do about that. Right, RT, I just saw a message at the top right saying in intercept four bandits. Is that us or is that someone else? No, no, that, 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 that's us. That right, will be. Off you toot. Hey, valued viewers, this may be a little bit embarrassing in every way. So uh, this, all I can say is hold on. We've got it. We've got it. Oh, it's like riding a bike, RT. Like riding a village bike. Beautiful. Right, four bandits to intercept, apparently. Mother has told us where they are. I don't know I didn't listen. Man, Warbirds and DTS are so freaking awesome. Yeah, the bandits are basically heading down the French side of the Channel Coast from Dunkirk uh, and then will cross towards Dungeness. Alright, well, you're leading. I don't know my own country. What kind of trim have I got in this spit, RT? I can't remember. You've basically got rudder trim and uh, pitch trim. Right. What a beast! The Pride Cliffs of Dover! The Wine Cliffs! I'm just thinking about the Wine Cliffs, guys. Uh, what, uh, what, any idea what it is we're intercepting, RT? I wasn't listening, or you didn't say either one. A group of four uh, A8s. Oh, easy pickings. Low altitude. I mean, the only issue for a spit is they are quick. Yes, they are. I mean, they're easier to intercept in a Mustang because the Mustang's got the speed. RB, is that the Mustang with the Allison or the Merlin in? It's a bit Merlin. It's a bit murky this morning. Roger. I see some areas and strikes on chain home radar sites. Smoke in the English fields. They're just, they're just markers to help you find your way around, uh, so it is in the face of a blue smoke in essence. There's another one um, down at Limpney. There's a lot of AAA sort of along the coast as well to watch out for. Right. There you go, boys, I'm coordinated. Oh, much slipperier. They'll be low down between 500 and 1,000 feet. Basically just inland of the coast. Uh, and then eventually they will turn and cross the channel. Making a very slow turn to run parallel to the coast until we pick them up. Help with the sun rising our eyes. Mm -hmm. You see anything, RV? No, nothing yet. Triple A coming from the two o'clock low, obviously.
this right, we're gonna catch him on the ground. Coming up on Dunkirk now. Oh god. Yeah, feels at uh, what, sort of one o'clock. Okay, let's go to trail formation, I'll be Roger. Combat incoming. I'm just wondering if we missed them and they actually uh, had gone past us before we took off. That'd be embarrassing. Cap tally, targets uh, 9 o'clock, left turn. And World War II is hard. Ah, oh, that is a boat. Are they friendly boats out there, RT? There are enemy boats. There. Right. I'm, I'm turning back right towards Dunkirk. Okay, turning back with you guys. Damn it, I'm sure it's all four dots. So annoying. There's a convoy of uh, red cargo ships. There's also a red submarine floating apart, a sort of off Manston. Okay. And then there will be three Schnell boats as well. I'm thinking they, that that uh, they must have already gone past us. Yeah, sure. Uh, before we took off. I mean, we can beat up the uh, Dunkirk air base if okay. you want. Okay, works for me. Looks like there's a plane moving on the ground. Put some traces out when you can. I've got no uh, vision on Dunkirk. I'm not sure how what it looks like. Yeah, watch out, there's triple A sort of up to the uh, left of the runway. Right. Uh, yeah, there's something taking off. You're right, RT, there's something taking off. It's now airborne. Cap's homing in on it. Cap wet. Now tracing uh, RB. It's a fat nose 180. Cap rolling in. 109 just took off. That was 109, okay. Roger that. Yeah, there's a 180 though, uh, heading over. Done. Eight. Right, that's a Mustang. Is that you in a dogfight, RB? Nope. Is that you? It must be you, RT, then. Yeah, I'm on a red nose 109, but he's hanging over his triple A, so it's hard to, hard to really get him. Dogfight, heading inland. Man, this rocks. Yeah, all that friggin' IL-2 training's paying off finally. She shoots stuff now. I'm 10 miles south, not that that provides you with any uh, security. I've chewed into pieces, guys, it's still flying, but. Here comes RB! Ha ha ha! Yeah, baby! It's a dog fight! Oh, 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 he's just stamped on his rudder. Oh, it's a human fire! It's a human pilot! All the sweeter, boys. All the sweeter. I just saw him stamping his rudder. AI would never do that. Ha <laughs> Let's give him boom boom. Hey, let's dive in. Watch your wings. Watch your wings. Mighty Kerr first. Soaking up a lot of bullets. I need you to get up out there, RB. I can't get after him. 
Roger. It's much faster in a climb that aircraft valley viewers. I'm gonna stay low. Yeah, give him boo boo. There is a problem with the World War II damage model though in that uh, on occasions you can essentially what should shoot down a plane but it turns into a ghost and it just keeps flying around often inverted and oh, after that it's vi virtually impossible to kill them. <coughs> is that AI or human? That's AI. This is a human so it should be fine. You just soaking a lot, soaking up a lot of damage, but yeah, well, it does model where you hit, mm. and if you don't hit critical components, you know you'll keep going. Got to get that radiator value, viewers. Yeah, that's what you're looking for. Yeah. The radiator, the engine, uh, the fuel tank. Yo -yo. And cut that corner, I've been cutting off. Down eventually. Tally someone going uh, up the coast towards Dunkirk. Nope, not us. Come on him. Jesus, how did he get up there? We're up at 10,000 feet. Holy oh, splash. Splash, splash AA. Well, nice work. Okay, careful on that dive, careful on that dive. Dangerous, dangerous, dangerous. God, he's picked up a lot of speed. He's got 400 knots. Mad thing, that is. I think he's going to treat us to some aerobatics. Nice hits.
Charlie, another one heading just off the coast again, heading north towards Dunkirk. Roger. We've gone way north. Bloody Eddie Rickenbacker and a bloody 109 for a takedown. There's a pair of them. I think uh, I think they're the remainder of the AAs, possibly heading for home. I haven't overspent my prop or over my wings yet or heat compressibility. Must be a record for me. Still with me, RB? Yeah, I fell out a little bit, but I'm back to get back in. Winchester on cannon, just machine guns left. Oh, who the fuck shoot me now? You wanna warn me about that RB though? I've got a fucking mesh smell on my back. Right, I've got another one here. Okay, the internet has arrived. Let's do them, boys. Okay, you sweet mother. Okay, keep an eye for red nose, it's gonna come back. Red nose is back. I'm on white nose. Hits. White nose is bleeding. I'm Winchester. There are two A8s uh, where I'm south of Dunkirk over Reveline, I think it is, where the two big sticky out things go into the sea. You keep your Hornets valued, viewers. I'm going to stick in these planes, I think. Nice dance with these guys, they ain't got any ammo. Let's see if I can take them out in their face. <laughs> oh shit, I saw myself. How are you doing, RB? Um, chase Moron and being chased. <laughs> A really nice formation flight going on with him. Damn it. I'm Winchester, guys. I'm heading home. Woo! What a great fight. Okay, well, at least we damaged Red Mouth, human. And, uh, 
and his wingman. I'm going to have to go RB unless... Oh, I can't really help you, I've no idea where you are. Okay then, fuel gauge. About 30% left. I'll meet you guys at Manston. Whoever's, whoever's RTB. Yeah, I'm heading RTB, heading for Manston. Oh, wait, yeah, he mills have opened up on me, brilliant. Such a cool simulator. Ah, they got me ranged in! Screw you! Lots of weaving about. <laughs> Out of range! Ha ha ha! See it, douchebags! I'm going back to Anglais! Speaking of which, tally Anglais! God, you know the great thing about the Battle of Britain? Not even the Battle of Britain, the, just this whole section of World War II is everything is so small. I can literally see my base from the enemy country. Not kidding, it's literally there. Yeah, I mean, you can get a decent length of flight on this channel map as well if you if you sort of do a strike and go the long way round and tack them from the back. Roger, I well, mean, you can get something like a 40-minute flight. Let's uh, RTB at uh, Manston and then we'll go out together and uh, do another attack. That was actually a pretty good attack. We damaged two aircraft badly. Yeah, I took out some of the ground units at Dunkirk nice. as well. And you hit an A8 apparently as well. Yeah. I got two following me. Nice. Oh, you got two? We'll get you freaking, you're in a Mustang. Yep. Get your skates on and get uh, back to Whitey. Oh, that's where I'm heading. Fuel is, whoa, 20%, 20%. This thing drinks fuel. Jesus Christ. I'm not even kidding. I'm wondering if you've been hit and you've got a fuel leak. Nah, so, I've just been on. Mine, mine's got gallons left. I've just been on wet. I'm in the dog sun solid stop dog fight. Well, Manston's about the furthest away oh, airfield. I mean, well, you what's the closest back, then? Probably back to Hawkins where we took off. I'm going to need guiding. Someone's got to guide me. I, I wouldn't know how to get to Hawkins. Value viewers? Aim Value viewers? For, aim for. Dover, which is the, 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 the middle of the White Cliffs, right. where the uh, smoke is rising up from, that's Dover. Yep. And Hawkinge is basically, if you go to the end of the left set of White Cliffs, yep. it's just uh, uh, it's just sort of close to there. Right, I'm heading there then. Bye bye Francoise, I'll see you in hell. How are we doing RB? Pretty good, I think I lost. Nice. Both of them where they broke off. Successful freaking flight, one might say, so far. Tally three Schnell boats, mid channel. I'm doing much about it now. Try and lock their position somehow. Yeah, ju ju just uh, be aware that they're throwing out AAA. Mm. So I'll put a mark on them. What's a reasonable fuel saving RPM? About, probably about two, four hundred RPM. Done. And if you put your boost just Jeez. just a fraction above four, then... Uh, Roger, I'm on 11% fuel. Okay, boost is just about four. RPM is 2400. This is going to sip less than a freaking Toyota Prius, boys. Sip, sip, sip. That be bad, frugal. Eh? Be frugal. Be frugal a little bit, five. We've got to get back. Oh, I've seen something in the sea, RT. I have seen something in the sea. Explosions in the sea. What in earth's going on? Oh, don't tell me I'm about to miss a massive battle. I'm guessing somebody is taking a pot shot at, shot at those snail boats, perhaps. Um, it's, it's green tracer. Where is it coming from? I don't. Ah, uh, that's coming from the snail boats. Right. That's them shooting at you. Lovely. Good to know. Oh, there's an aeroplane over them. Oh, it's RB. Uh, knock it off and come to... Where are we going, Hardy? No, I'm heading that Hawking. way. 
my gun. Man, I think my motor just died. Oh, this is what happens if you fuck around. I did take a lot of hits, so it's possible that it's got damage. Eight percent, eight gallons. Uh, I think you've been hit, Cap, and you got a leak. Because well, I'm, well, I'm still, well, I'm still showing full on my gauge. Well, that's and I only, and I reduced it down to seventy percent fuel before I took off. Right, throttle is right, RPM is whoa, literally triple A going up from below me. How about you? Oh, oh, the snowboats! How did I go over all the snowboats? Man, World War Two is a hostile freaking place. Leave me alone. Best thing for taking out the Schnell boats are the H4 rockets on the P-51 or the P-47. You can take them out with cannon from the Spitfire. It's just uh, takes a bit longer. Looking at that amount of fire, I would say that's a suicide mission. Tally RB behind me, hopefully. As long as you don't fly straight, as long as you fly a curved path to them, it yeah. tends to throw them off. I think that might be me behind you. Oh, Tuxor decided to materialise. This is excellent. I don't think I'm going to make it, I'm going to have to ditch. Three miles inland uh, from there. It's sort of stuck Sweet. up on a fairly high plateau. That'd be nice. Oh, I desperately want to go wet. I only like flying in wet. Anything else just doesn't suit me. Okay, fine, I'm looking for the... Never use thing. it. Where is the... Okay, I see a smokestack. Is it in a relation to that? Turn around the white cliffs. I'm at the white cliffs now. Right. Heading, heading two knots. There you go. Yeah, if you're pretty much on course, okay. right, you're right, right into hawking. Tuck saw. Don't do anything weird now. You won't. Have I ever? I get to get a canopy when I get back. How about that? Yeah, real life canopy. Like, do something useful and go and find the Hawkins. Pretty much in front of us. Yeah, well, everyone keeps saying that, but guess what I can't see? Can't see, can't see about your one o'clock. Oh, is that oh, a tiny little strip of land? You are yeah, kidding me. It's about a couple miles just past the cliff. Yeah, I see it. It looks yeah, like a you small can, You can course. see the hangars and the buildings. Yep. Right, rolling in, boys. Final check on the gasoline, and we've got break. 4% max. Let's do this. Gallon has just glided it in. For the spit, for rearming and refueling, you do not have to switch off your engine, you do not nice. have to open your canopy. The canopy is not a problem. <laughs> not indeed. <laughs> All finals, field. Have a good field. I almost equipped a tree. That would be embarrassing, guys. We landed like 40 knots. Convergence! No, no, no. We, we got it. We got it. Hey, you're okay. It's you're okay. Fine. Nice landings, guys. It was, it was a nice landing, wasn't it? Oh, rare. Now, what I always forget is to put my flaps back up. Right. <laughs> it makes, makes taking off difficult. Unfortunately, it's that time. Bye-bye, RB. Later. See Made it back with 3% fuel, boys. But that, sir, was a successful mission. Okay, everyone, let's arm up again. There's plenty of measurements to go and dogfight. I need dogfighting. If I can figure out how to stop this plane, then I will. But I can't. There we go. Bit of rolling resistance. Right, guys. Well, that was about as much fun as anything can get. So, okay. Uh, fuel, 6%. That's so funny. Uh, don't want any bombs or nothing. Gun ammo full. What do I want? Armor piercing. Ba, 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 ba. Right, go. Will RT. Go, boys. Oh, or not. Off you go, lead. Glory. 
one slightly embarrassing thing is I completely forgot to repair, so I'm probably still full of bullet holes. But you know what? We'll figure it out. We'll do what we do. Or we do! Got to set takeoff trim, Alti. That was very nearly very ugly. Took off sidewards and about 90 degrees angle of attack. Luckily, it's pretty much as possible to store Spitfire. You coming, Tuxel? I am with you, just going. Here. Right, heading for the smoke at Dover at the minute. The modelling of Dover on this map's really cool with the radar, the castle, and everything. It's really good. So it is. I'm just going to gun test. Guns are good, baby. Right, set course for Baddie Land. Let's go and get some freaking measures of it, Tarty. That's an hors d'oeuvre. Somebody what? lagged. What was that? Somebody's lagging to the sea. That's nearly. That's, that's me, Tarty. I had a freeze, but I'm back. Hold up. That is why I say you shouldn't have bombs stores that get hung. That's your mission over. It's your, it's your one day a week of trying DCS over. People just don't seem to understand. I'm on your left wing, Captain. Right, really Ish. Well, certainly on the spit, you can do most missions without any bombs, because the cannon is so good, air to ground as well as air to air. Um, you only really need bombs if you're taking out big buildings, something like that. Oh, look, dead on my nose, there's the Schnell boats again. Right, well, we don't really want to tangle with them, do we? Oh, I don't know, I'm tempted. You're cool. And in fact, between the Schnell boats and the coast are the two uh, red cargo ships as well. Oh, H-bar rockets take those out very yeah, nicely. I was going to say, 707s ain't going to do much. There we go, up comes the AAA from the Schnell boats. Probably going to regret this, but that's a pop additional thing. Two percent down. Wow, nice. I got hits, but I don't have the VDA display. Okay. What is the uh, keeper? got really rather upset. Haven't they? Aren't they upset? One guy's just continuously firing like a complete knob. Yeah, that's got to be a bug. Yep. We're going to put the one on the right, yeah? Yeah. Let's do it. Dart is getting absolutely pasted. 82%. Splash, jack, whatever. Middle one next. Yeah. Get the old adrenaline going. Yes. Luckily, I think they've been drinking all day. I 
my BDA display doesn't work. Turn I definitely got hit. Did you turn it on, Dark Soul? I did. Uh, According to the uh, findings. It's never worked in 10 months. You've got it turned on in private settings. Uh, that's another question. How embarrassing for you. How's he looking, RT? 39% on the middle one. Well done. I'm going to try a side attack. I know it's a bit... No, I'm not. It's a stupid idea. Well, they never run out of ammo. Nope, they never do. Should we get running in? Wow, they really move at some great knots, don't they? Ninety-two percent. Oh, I'm gonna finish him off. I'm gonna get the steal the kill there. Which one is that? RT? Which one? That is Drag. what was the centre one. It's gone. So that's just the one remaining now, which is the one on the left. Yes, sir. Doom. Who is facing? It gets less dangerous once you get the other ones down. Mm. One left, I think. Running in. Okay. Okay. And someone's crashed into it. That's me. Embarrassing, <laughs> right. I think it's me as well, apparently. Brilliant. Well done, guys. I don't know, actually. I might just have blacked out, actually. <laughs> you blacked out, but I'm under the water and alive. Yeah, so am I. <laughs> right, well, I uh, killed him Maybe anyway. that aqua lung wasn't too bad by after all. I'm coming back to, um, not Leclerc, Hawkins, because I'm all out of ammo now. There you go, guys. That is three snow boats down. Pretty happy about that. I get to use my beautiful weck as well. Which way is England, guys? That way, isn't it? Ich liebe gern England. You can see why I spend so much time on these World War II servers. Yeah. They are just a blast. Yeah. Absolutely. Better than blast. any modern combat, I'll tell you that. Yeah. The other thing I always forget is to set my altimeter. Oh. On split, it is always a couple of thousand feet drift. Okay, why? That doesn't sound right. No idea. It's, it, I've not seen it in any of the other planes, but the Spitfire is always about 2,000 feet to 2,500 feet drift. Right. Question is, do you go faster without a co uh, cockpit canopy? Oh, well, there you go.
now flying at no miles an hour about three feet above the ground is just showing off cap yes I do like showing off not guys hating. i thoroughly enjoyed that i'm not gonna lie and wing wing with wing two foot and a half foot wing wing and spitfire is god mode it's yeah so it's good really good I yeah i mean i on my warthog i've got to actually set the curves way way down just to be able to keep control of the thing i feel like i could go and just pick off a bunch of f-18s now and just go like yeah you suck you can <laughs> all right i'm gonna probably call it a night there unless there's any very quick missions that need doing on here no not really i mean from now on it's really mostly air to ground uh, there are a lot of ground targets to strafe but um yeah. all right well, uh, if you want a public server with World War II, anyone out there, that is friggin' awesome. And I'll definitely be spending some more time on there if I ever get any free time, which is basically never. But otherwise, really enjoy that, guys. Great work, and I will see you to uh, probably on Sunday, by the sounds of it. Okay, see you, Cap. Bye -bye. And Dr. Okay. embarrassed himself again. I did some purpose. <laughs> I made the video. Oh, you made it on purpose. This is all for the video. I see. I'll make sure I write that in the credits.